photo shoot I just with to my have friend. A life. So basically, did I, after after the house, did I ever have any photo shoot with anyone? It was just her, because I knew genuinely how I felt about Lucy, and I, it's, it hasn't changed. Um. It's just her as a sister. You guys, this particular reunion is a movie on its own, as in seriously. And to think that Katrina only spent two weeks in the house and it's just been like the whole reunion has been all about Katrina. Like Katrina is saying one thing or the other or is it being involved in almost everything that happened in the house. It's really like surprising. Hey guys, welcome back again to my channel. My name is Vicky. If you're watching me for the very first time, hi please consider to hit on that red subscribe button by your right hand side and subscribe to my channel and do not forget to turn on your notification bell so that youtube will inform you whenever i post a new video oh crrr. guys tonight and uh, see hmm then beat person tonight too tonight hey this this big brother and that show really eh? we all have to just adjust our seat belts because we don't even know what is unfolding in each day okay guys it started like this ebuka was asking you know they came outside the house now now everything they talked about tonight was outside the house what happened outside the house and of course you know the people that had a little drama outside the house was lucy and katrina so ebuka was asking katrina why she decided to unfollow everybody and even lucy her friend the drama that has been going on between she and lucy before Katrina could say anything, Tolani Baraj actually said that she felt that Katrina, in fact, a lot of people felt that Katrina followed them because they attended Nengi's birthday party. And I'm like, Katrina, what is really your problem with Nengi? Because I feel like Katrina has a lot against Nengi that I don't even know where the problem is coming out from. I don't even know how it generated. I beg, if you now know what they cause Katrina beef, this beef that as in I don't know how to settle or they don't even know how to settle, please leave it in the comment section. I really want to know what this beef is about because I did crack my head since. I don't really see Katrina and Nengi get that kind of friction or confrontation. The only person I knew had a confrontation with Nengi in the house was Lucy. So what's Katrina's problem with this girl? Anyway, she was like, she came out and she denied. They, though Watoni said that she also felt that um, Katrina unfollowed almost all of them because of the fact that they are not interacting on her post and katrina went along to feel like they are not loyal they don't like her that is why she unfollowed them and i'm like how many people is loyal to the rest of the housemate they but they follow each other that's because they actually were in the same space i feel like people are in the same space and you don't even have to be best of friends to actually to actually be cordial you understand so following the person wouldn't take so much that's what i feel and Katrina was defensive that eh, no, she's just I think she was she's just following Kid Wire. Who else? Kid Wire, one other person, and the rest. She even unfollowed Lacon, which she went ahead to explain that she unfollowed Lacon because she and Lacon had a relationship of mother son. Lacon calls her mom in the mommy in the house, and she calls Lacon's son. And then when she was commenting on Lacon's pictures on Instagram, his fans were like, they should stop referring to their king like that or their guy like that, you guess. And Lacon did not address the issue with his fan. He kept making them drag her. So she actually unfollowed him, even though Lacon really apologized there that he's sorry that he could not attend to all the messages, sorry, all the comments he's been having on his Insta Instagram page, you understand? Though they've unfollowed each other and all that and all that, then Ebukana went to her issue with her bestie lucy like if katrina and lucy could not last as friends hey <laughs> ah, see me i'm just trying my best anyway anyway guys lucy and um, katrina went ahead to say that that lucy is not a loyal friend that lucy like what i ex understood because she was not specific even though ebuka kept pressing that what is really your problem as in what do you really feel she kept saying that lucy is not loyal that she got out of the house, you, you assumed or you believed she had beef with Nengi, then you realized she was not cool with Nengi and she yeah. didn't tell you. Why is that a bad thing? So I'm only going to the assume. Loyalty Give is, me what it is. Ebuka, the loyalty is, tell me so that you're not cool with this person. With, yes. that, that was your problem. Yes. But that's what I've been asking So that I would know. Let me not see it on social media. You see, she felt that Lucy went back to be friends with Nengi and she's an enemy with Nengi because that's all I could get from this whole thing. Maybe that's not the word, it's not word for word what she actually said, but that's all I could get. What she's trying to say is that if she's friend with 
you you shouldn't be friends with somebody she tends to be her enemy which doesn't make any sense i cannot inherit your enemy when there's nothing because lucy and Nengi had a friction. They settled it in the house. And you heard Nengi, um, Lucy coming out to make a statement about Nengi, which has been trending till today. Lucy made a statement like, have you seen Nengi when they were comparing Nengi and Erica? Lucy was like, have you met Nengi? That thing is still on everybody's lips till today. You understand? So I don't see any reason why she would be because Katrina is having beef with Nengi. So she should just just follow up and just be enemies with in fact katrina has issues with everybody because at this point this is her boss lady here you know she's not just sitting down properly with a lot of people you understand so lucy her own point was that okay if you had these issues with me i don't even know what happened you understand so why didn't you talk about it with me why did you have to bring it to the reunion yeah and i see reasons with lucy you have issues with her you know what your problem is or you know where your anger is which she does not know she has been asking you which lucy said she's been chatting her even on dming her commenting asking her what's up and she's not been telling her what the problem is you understand so why bring it here and she was crying trying to make us believe that that she really likes lucy she's she's very loyal friend to lucy lucy is not loyal blah 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 guys at this point i don't even know whether their story ended whether they will go back to being friends or not because at the end of the day katrina said she doesn't want to be talking about anything that has to do with lucy and lucy was like she's okay with it and that was where it actually ended for them so i don't know whether this their relationship will continue after this reunion i've been mean, a non settler because they don't tell me they shoot the movie as in the reunion you understand so i don't know where it be but guys the bass goes when happened this night now after that now kind shack on come she sat down and they were asking them about it's like there's a fracas between kaisha lucy and katrina well it was mostly between lucy and katrina and kaisha you understand and kaisha explained that they were having like a boat cruise or something like that and lucy was around her area or something like that and she felt like she told Kat, um, kaisha that she wanted to come with them you understand and katrina was there so her mom Kaisha's mom said she also wanted to join because her mom is also a more girl, you know, a UP lady you get. So she felt like, okay, the mom followed them. And then during the party or during the cruise or wherever they were, the mom somehow, somehow liked Katrina and was like, she would love to take a picture with Katrina. And like they explained, her sister went, Kaisha's sister went to tell um, Katrina about it. And Katrina was like, the mom should come to her house to take a picture her hey if katrina do this one like because i don't even know the law because she denied it and was saying that she didn't hear that it was her mom she was hearing her manager something something that's how she said it that she did not hear completely what her mom said and lucy was um kaisha was like i sent lucy to stay you the same thing lucy was trying to defend herself that i think i came after your sister had come to tell her you understand in fact the whole argument you know kaisha is very short tempered you understand very temperamental she was not having it she was shutting um our boss lady up she did not allow her talk and at some point she was like you guys should just die this thing please don't talk about my mom again i don't want to talk about my mom because during this argument of aisha explaining everything she was saying that she does not want to have issues with katrina that despite all what lucy has said about katrina to her she does not want to have issues with katrina and you know now when you hear that kind of thing say person say you don't gossip to another person to rap ingo won't know what will be the thing when i talk especially if you feel say you don't talk anything so you will be desperate to know that what did i really say please say it out so lucy was just restless looking for who to talk to like i beg what did i tell this game is it was it about fruit we don't know what the fruit was about you understand when kaisha actually shut everybody up she sat down and then lucy was like kaisha what did you even say is it and she, ah, kaisha was like please, please 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 i do not want anybody to talk about my mom anymore i don't and lucy was like are we are talking about fruit is your mom fruit did it? before we know what it happened oh, now so Kaisha carry throw pillow, stone Lucy. Now Lucy get up, give her boza. That's what I'm saying. It's, it's, okay. it's, I don't know why it's, it's just simple, Lucy. Okay, it's just simple. Oh, 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 Katrina has thing. respected herself. Oh, you don't even respect yourself. I don't care. I don't want anything that has to do with you. Katrina and you, I don't want it. I just told you not to talk anything about my mom anymore. Is it fruit? Your mom is Just respect yourself. I said fruit. Why is it Are you lying? Now so they start Big Brother Ninja advert. I don't even understand. Why they not even show? 
See, Kayo Day, we have we need to see Kayo Day because this whole drama and when Kayo Day they want us to they watch, it they pepper me. Because as I'm a boy when I be, I they like see the, the peak of the issue. We won't see him. So why did they cut it? I will show you guys the clip. Of course, you guys have seen it already. I want to know how Lucy used beat Kaisha or whether Kaisha later beat Lucy. Because from the narration we we'll get from that short clip it shows, it be like saying that Lucy beat Kaisha and I don't understand. So after they came back from the break, it was now bass goes between <laughs> between Tochi and Katrina. There's nothing there, so please come down from your high horse, cause the high the horse is even even low. <laughs> the, 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 the horse is even low, so come down from your high horse. You Nobody no cares. Point. No, I have my points. I'm telling you, I don't like bossy people. I don't like bullies. So that is exactly the way you are. Tochi was angry that Katrina unfollowed him. This follow follow matter. I don't know where they follow people. They go and they follow people go their village or follow people go their where then they cut soap for people. I beg, make you not come carry me. Let me follow, please. Because at this point, Ebuka was asking Tochi. So what made him angry? He was like. Um, Katrina asked, uh, they asked Katrina about following who he was, she was following and all that. She was like, if she's not following anybody, if she's not following you, she does not care about you. And then Tochi can't do your own Q&A on top of Instagram. They can't ask and say whether I know who be Katrina. He can't say no, no. Whether Katrina, who be Katrina? Katrina the name of a person, a be animal place or thing. That's what Tochi been talk for that in Q&A then. So they now start a fracas. Omo, Tochi's mouth is stinkingly smelling. Is that an English like that? <laughs> Tochi game, you don't even want to have scratch with Tochi. Tochi will finish it. Tochi was like, calm down from that your high horse. Take that your high horse to Ikurudu. I'll be where the devil. I'll be mushy. I'll be where. Calm down from your high horse. It's not even high. It's even low. You're too full of yourself. You're too that. You know now, Katrina, when she see problem like that, she need a fit argue. She need a fit talk plenty. Tochi just mesmerize her with drama. As in, I think I'll have to put a clip for you guys to watch. Anyway, guys, that was just the drama that happened in tonight's BB Ninja. This thing is sweet as the day they go. It they make us we am a boy like this. Don't be looking at me like that because you guys are making me feel like saying I'm mean, only me like I'm a boy. For you to watch this video, you like I'm a boy. So I'm a boy like us, me and you. We like I'm a boy. And as they, they go, it's really making the show interesting. And I'm always here to bring it to you guys. Thank you so much for watching my video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please, if you did, give it a thumbs up. Leave me a comment in the comment section. And please subscribe if you haven't turned on your notification bell so that YouTube will inform you whenever I post a new videos i'll most definitely see you guys in my next one why am i mushy mushy like i'm in love with all of you bye guys